Following her postpartum weight loss, Keek Palmer rejects unrealistic body standards. The first person to embrace her voluptuous postpartum body was Keek Palmer. Leedy's mother is speaking out about the pressure celebrities experience to snap back to their pre-pregnancy proportions five months after giving birth to her son. She discussed the difficulties of maintaining her physical fitness for her work in an interview with her personal trainer, Corey Calliott, on her baby, This Is Keek Palmer podcast on August 8th. She also urged listeners to resist unrealistic body ideals. Palmer mentioned from personal experience that a snapback is frequently part of the damn gig. She remarked, looking attractive and professional is part of our employment. Therefore, don't think that we are doing it because that is how it is, or something like. No, the position is in jeopardy. We must be who we must be if we want the checks to be signed. Celebrities have long served as models of health and beauty, imposing unrealistic standards on the average person. Palmer stressed, however, that celebrities, like herself, enjoy a number of benefits that hasten their fitness journeys. I'm doing my job. Let's keep it in check. I don't want anyone to believe I'm imposing impossible standards, she remarked. I can afford a personal trainer, meal preparation, and many other things. Despite the cost, I am investing in my profession. Palmer continued by advising followers against trying to adopt the idealistic wellness regimens of celebrities. Despite this, she acknowledged that it feels nice to return to the gym after taking some time off. Especially after having a child, we have to be encouraged for where we're at, instead of trying to change, she said. After having a child, so many things about you change, including your physique and thinking. However, you simultaneously want to give it all you've got and feel like you're making a difference for yourself. In the end, Palmer stressed that every person's path to well-being is distinct and that the key to maintaining top mental and physical health is to pay attention to your individual body's demands. I never want to impose that on somebody because it's a personal decision, she added. And that's important to me because I'm aware that I'm viewed by many people and that I stand in for many different types of individuals. For this reason, I constantly want to emphasize that your journey is your journey, particularly when I'm discussing fitness, health, and wellness. You work it out as best you can.